all this time of year when it gets dry, I mean it gets, it gets, it gets like ice really. Well slick. And uh, like I said on the, the, the uh, what was it, slurry bin, that's why we were chucking water about. Because uh, it dries up, you don't get, you know, it's ground temperature's warm, so uh, the cows are only in for short periods, you know, in the morning and in the evening. So don't, um, it just gets real slick. And when you've got slick floors, it means the cows go down. I'll end up probably giving this a wet tomorrow, I think. Even though it's not, it's not warm today. Is it 15 degrees? No sun. We're supposed to get some showers later. summer carving yard in the winter it's normally got the uh, the little group of milkers in but uh, we have a bit of a swap round during the summer you see we've got quite a few to carve and that one there I'm not sure was that 15 could be 15 well, I thought 15 was more white than that she's in the first stages of carving Oh, she's gonna lay down again now. <laughs> that grunt tells you she's carving. We'll go and um, uh, put silage up and then come and see what she's doing. She ought to be able to sort it out herself. Poor old girl. Got a smart 13 ton Komatsu. Uh, Short radius digger on hire. Well, it's just come off hire actually uh, from AT Services. Uh, out the back in uh, in the wood. Oh, there's. Um, it's a basically. Uh, it's mainly. It's mainly a poplar wood. And over the past, I don't know, five six years, fifty percent of the poplar trees have gone over. You know, with the wind and this. You know, this that and the other. 
So there's a um, uh, forestry team in there at the minute um, clearing it all up. And they had this on hire with a grab, um, their own grab. Um, because they did have a forwarder in there. Um, the forwarder had to go, I don't know why, but the forwarder had to go back for some reason, so they had this on hire this week um, with a grab so they could continue sorting the timber. Um, but uh, yeah, smart machine. I think I think there's another t uh, another forwarder coming, so uh, if I get a chance, I'll get a bit of footage of it in action. But uh, yeah, it's a smart machine. I could uh, do a bit of damage with one of them, I reckon. I don't know what uh, age it is, it's not very old because it's got the 360 camera system on it like. Uh, uh, yeah, smart machine. It'd be very useful that would. Very useful. <laughs> do's and don'ts. Let's have a look at the do's and don'ts. Do not put ablu into the diesel tank. Do not put water into the ablu tank. Do not put diesel into the ablu tank. Do not use dirty equipment such as funnels, jugs or oil containers for refilling the ablu tank. Failure to adhere to these cold lines could result in substantial damage to the vehicle and incur expensive repair, repair charges. It's more I'll do that um, they have to put these sort of stickers on now. It's, just, it's common sense, isn't it? But I suppose our industry, they get all sorts of buffets um, operating them, don't they? So they have to put this sort of stuff on to cover their own arse, don't they? But, uh, yeah, some of them don't know a great deal about diggers. That looks a good, nice digger to me. The old April Pro is still going splendidly. She's on uh, 1,546 hours now. And continues to perform, well, brilliantly, basically. You couldn't really ask for a lot more. It's so nice that she's got a, <laughs> she's got a mate here now as well. She's got a fast track keeping the company. The old three one. There we go, that's twiddling done. Shall we do it though? <laughs> I haven't fired her up in a month, more than a month, I shouldn't think. Let's fire her up, shall we? Bugger it. I'm going to sit you just on that bucket there.
better see what I'm doing in the dark now. So 15 has carved it herself. Been about half an hour now. And little, it's a little heifer calf, little fem female calf. She's already trying to get up, isn't ya? Mum's been licking her. Good mum she is. I'm not sure how many lactations she's had, but you're not a young cow, are you, 15? So there we go, it's a new life to finish the video on. Lovely to see, it's always nice to have it. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. Nearly. Bit more practice, mate, and you'll be, you'll be standing, and then she'll go to the milk bar. Gonna have a suck, get some colostrum. There you go, anyway. I hope you enjoyed that little vid. And we'll see you on the next one, won't we? Ta ta!